to Total Circuit Training Yoga. Yoga is an extremely important part of the overall conditioning of your mind, body, and spirit. It relaxes you and greatly increases your flexibility. Now, what I want you to do now is find the time and the place where it's nice and quiet, you have no one to bother you, and remove your socks and shoes because you're now getting ready to go through the workout. I have a fantastic instructor here, Megan, who's going to take you through a 20-minute awesome beginner's yoga workout. Megan, are you ready? I'm ready. Take it away. Hi, welcome to Beginning Yoga. So what we're going to do first is the sun salutation. I'd like you to watch me first, and then you're going to join my group, and you at home are going to join me in the exercise. So first, we're going to go ahead and inhale, bring the arms up, exhale, nice stretch forward. From here, you're going to inhale. On your exhale, you're going to bring your left leg back. Then you're going to bring your right leg back. You're going to hold in the plank position. Then you're going to arch into a cobra. And then you're going to exhale and push back to a downward dog. Then you're going to go back to the plank position. Bring your right leg in. Bring your left leg in. And we're going to slowly start to roll up to the starting position. So I want you to go ahead and get up and join my group as we start the sun salutation. Ready? So we're going to inhale. Nice deep breath through the nose, never stopping breathing. Exhale, diving forward. Take an inhale. Now on your exhale, go ahead and extend your left leg behind you. Now inhale, exhale, extend your right leg back. You're in your balanced plank position. From here, you're gonna inhale. On your exhale, extend into a cobra, lifting the sternum to the ceiling. Inhale, exhale, bring your bottoms in the air. Stretch into downward dog. We're now gonna go slowly, inhale, exhale, back into your plank position. Inhale, exhale, bring your right leg in. Now bring your left leg in. Inhale, now slowly pulling those belly muscles in towards your spine, rolling on up to a standing position to start again. Inhale, lift. Exhale, slowly forward bend. Inhale, on your exhale, right leg goes back. Inhale, exhale, left leg goes back. In, exhale through the mouth to the cobra. Inhale, exhale, bottoms up, downward dog. Inhale, exhale to plank. left foot in, bring your right foot in, and slowly rolling up to a standing tall position. From here, we're going to go into a warrior pose. So what I want you to do is put your hands on your hips, take your left foot out to the side, take your right foot and turn it towards the wall, and you want to bring your arms out to the side. So now you're in warrior. From here, we're going to place our right arm down and take a side angle stretch, reaching the left arm high above the head. From here, go ahead, lunge deeper into warrior. And exhale into side angle. And back to warrior. Now you're going to go into triangle. So you're going to straighten the leg, reach the right arm down towards the floor. Now with the flexibility doesn't allow you to do that, it is okay to start from either here, your shin, or reach.
stretch all the way down to the floor. Go ahead and bend the right knee, back to warrior. Now you're gonna go ahead and straighten out the right knee and go back to triangle. So you wanna make sure that those hips stay forward, that arm reaches up to the ceiling, and you rotate the head if you can and look towards your arm. Bring that arm down and you wanna go back to warrior one last time. Good. And from the warrior position, we'll come into a straight leg position. Rotate your toes now back to forward. And we're gonna just slightly bend the spine forward. What I want you to do is really reach those hamstrings nice and long and reach the top of your head all the way forward. From here, you're gonna lower your spine, clasp behind you, and if you can, reach the arms together and stretch out the shoulders. If that's too much for you, you can stay in this position. Now we'll come back out to center and we'll slowly come back up. Left leg rotates, lunge to warrior. From here, you're gonna bend your left arm, place it on your leg and side angle stretch. What you wanna do is create a nice long line from fingertip all the way down to the ankle. She's gonna go back now into warrior. And again, side angle stretch. Remember to breathe. You wanna inhale nice and deep through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Good. And now we're gonna go into triangle. You're gonna straighten the leg, reach the arm down. And remember, if that flexibility doesn't allow, Go ahead and place it on your leg, on your shin, or all the way towards the floor. Good, you wanna make sure that this arm is reaching all the way up to the ceiling. You wanna make sure this arm is nice and straight, reaching towards the floor. Hips are forward. Now you're gonna exhale and come right back up to warrior one last time. And now you're gonna come back, rotate the toes back forward. One more forward bend. Nice flat back, clasp the hands, exhale, and stretch. Come back into that flat back position. Come all the way up to standing. Bring your feet together. And let's just take a nice deep breath into the nose. And a nice exhale through the mouth. Good, and let's do that one more time. Good, so what we're doing here is just cleansing the body. We're going ahead and filling up the body with good air and we're exhaling all the stressful air. So now we're gonna go into one more sun salutation. Inhale to lift the arms. Exhale, forward bend. Inhale, now exhale, bring that right leg back. Bring your left leg back. Now from here, we're gonna go into a seated position. You can go ahead and let my group stay here for a moment. You can go ahead and just bring your feet in and bring your legs in front of you. But what my group is gonna do is turn to the side so you can see what we're doing. So they're gonna bring their right leg up and just sit their bottoms down and face the side. So here we're gonna do a seated forward bend. You wanna flex the feet, bring the arms up, and lean forward. You wanna reach for your toes and you wanna to try to lengthen your spine all the way to a flat position. If that's too challenging, go ahead and put your hands on the shins or on the knees and work up to reaching for the toes. Then you wanna point the toes and hang forward. Now flex the toes and go into flat back. One more, point the toes and leaning forward. Good, from here they're gonna sit up nice and tall. 
Go ahead and rest their hands on their shins. We're going to take another deep breath in through the nose and out through the mouth. Getting ready to lie down on their back. So they're going to go ahead and lie down. And what you want to do is bring your right knee in towards your chest. And then you want to extend your leg up towards the ceiling. Now, you want to lie your head all the way down. If that's tough for you, I want you to go ahead and bend your opposite leg. And don't focus so much on stretching the foot all the way to the ceiling, but keeping a small bend of the knee is fine also. From here, they want to take the inside of their leg, ankle, foot, whatever's comfortable, and they want to open to the side. So what we're doing is stretching the internal leg. You want to keep breathing and you want to make sure both hips stay planted on the ground.